Hello friends, my friend Kim from Hancock Homestead and Gardens is doing her version of Vlogmas, which is basically um, vlogging every day in December up until Christmas or the whole month of December, I'm not really sure which. Um, she re renamed it Yuletide Vlog, which I think is pretty cool. But anyway, a couple of her vlogs have really... Um, touched me a lot and one of them and I will link it below or I will try to put a card up in the corner whichever corner um, I don't know how to do that but I'm gonna try to figure it out on this video <laughs> so if there's a, t uh, a link either place um, go and check out her vlog um, but in, in this particular vlog, she was talking about how it's stressful on the holidays and you have stress for different reasons. Um, obvious things like the financial burdens of added expenses of things. And then she's also talking about how if you've lost a loved one, how the holidays can be really hard. And um, I found that aspect of her um, presentation very, very applicable to me. Um, as most of you know, and my new subscribers, subscribers if you don't already know, um, I lost my mother in May to cancer and it has been a very difficult time for me um, coping with her loss and missing her. And I found that Thanksgiving was especially difficult and I knew Christmas is going to be very difficult as well. And one of the things that Kim suggested that you do is make an ornament, buy an ornament, get some sort of ornament that um, sig is significant to your loved one and um, put it on the tree and, ev and every year when you hang it on the tree then you can remember the good memories of your loved one that has passed and hopefully it will help with the sorrow. And that really hit, struck me as something that I really ought to do um, to help me with the loss of my mom. And so I went on that night um, after I watched her vlog to um, the company Shutterfly. I don't know if you've ever um, done anything with Shutterfly. They do, I thought they just did like um, scrapbooks and calendars and things like that, but I've come to find out that they do just about anything that you can print a picture on. And so I got an ornament that I um, had for me to remember my mom. And I have not opened the package yet. I wanted my first reaction um, of seeing it to be genuine and, and I wanted to share that with you. And hopefully I don't cry, but I can't guarantee anything. <laughs> so here we go. Hopefully they got it right. Sometimes they make mistakes. Okay, so they've got it double packaged because I ordered a glass ornament. So, let's see. Here we go. And they had um, all their ornaments were 50% off when I ordered this. Oh, now it's inside a really beautiful um, bag that I can store it in when I put it in with my um, ornaments after Christmas. I can't guarantee I'll put this ornament up this year though. I may keep it out for the whole year, hang it on my, in my office. Okay, now they've got it wrapped in. There's a really pretty silver ribbon to, to hang it on the tree. I'll have to thread that. And then they've got it packaged in like a bubble wrap type material. says in loving memory and then it has her birthday May 10th 1932 and then the day she died May 1st 2016 May 1st 2016 if you didn't hear that I knew I was going to cry. <laughs> this picture I think was taken on my uh, mom and dad's 60th wedding anniversary. And of 
course my dad was standing next to her and I had to crop him out because <laughs> this is specifically her ornament and I thought this was just a beautiful picture of her. Thank you, Kim, for suggesting I do this. I knew I was going to cry. I just knew it. Anyway, um, let me get it together here. <laughs> Thank you, Kim, so much for this suggestion. And I'm going to cherish this ornament of my mom. And uh, if you've lost a loved one, I would suggest you do something similar. And like I said, I will link that video um, of Kim's vlog below. All right, friends, thanks so much for uh, being here and sharing this time with me. And uh, I just, I knew I couldn't um, open this without sharing it with you, my friends. And I just can't get this ribbon tied. <laughs> so I'm gonna go ahead and close for now. And I'm gonna, I'll go hang it on a tree, on the tree, and then I'll show you where I hung it. Okay, so this is my tree um, that is down in the basement. And um, I'm gonna be doing a separate video on uh, some of the ornaments that are on this tree and why we have two trees. But I wanted to show you where I put mom's ornament. It's right in the center. When I'm sitting on the couch, or laying on the couch, I'll be able to see it perfectly. Right in the middle of my tree.